この番組はご覧のスポンサーの提供でお送りしました。What's up, guys? Welcome back to the Fujiwara Tofu Cafe channel. Today we're gonna have Cherry coming with us today, and let me get you guys some update for the A6 first. So the body shop just called us yesterday, and they said the car is pretty much ready to be picked up. So in this episode, we're gonna go to the body shop and check out the A6 together and see if there's anything else needs to be fixed. If not, then most likely we're gonna take the A6 home today. Don't spill the coke. <laughs> the A6 actually has been at the body shop since the early September, I think. And honestly, I never had a full paint job on any of my cars before, so I'm so excited for this, but also nervous at the same time. Do you get what I mean? So yeah, en enough talking. I guess we'll see how it goes when we get there. So let's go. I think I see it. Oh shit! Oh, looks good. Are you guys ready? Let me show you. Let's hit it with the cinematic. This is it guys, the paint is done. What do you guys think? I know there's probably shit tons of um, initial D-Film A86 in the world. And so this is probably not that special to you guys. But man, check out the paint. It looks way better than the wrap we had before. So clean. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. So before the body shop stopped painting it, they actually helped us to uh, delete the side marker that used to be over here at this spot on both sides. And I was going to delete the antennas too and cover it up, but um, I decided to keep it because I use the radio sometimes too. And I also have the body shop help me to install the JDM muff flaps. I actually bought them like two years ago but I never get a chance to install it oh it looks so much better with the mud flaps now let's talk about our new bumper 
So I actually left the black part unpainted because that's how it's supposed to look like when it came out from the factory in Japan. So some of you guys might not know, but yeah, that's how it's supposed to look like. And I also noticed there's some overspray over here on the edge. So I'm probably gonna have them to fix it. And they also installed the corner lights in the wrong side. This is supposed to be on that side. So yeah, I'm probably gonna have them to fix it for me. Then next, I need to get the uh, JDM Trueno sticker and put it on the hatch right here. And also, of course, I also have to put the Fujiwara Tofu Shop sticker over here. But I actually just came up with a new idea. So I just put the Fujiwara Tofu Cafe logo over here instead. What do you guys think? Which one will look better? Let me know in the comments below. Some of you might wonder if I already have the Sankey bumper, why do I have to get another one? And it is because this bumper is actually made in fiberglass and it's actually made by a company called CF Spec Carbon which is my other business so that's why when I first got the A6 I decided to use a fiberglass bumper instead because I can't really find a OEM one back then I'm not gonna sell this one but I'm probably gonna save it when uh, we have an actual shop I'm probably gonna hang it on the wall as a display or something so yeah I'm probably gonna keep this one for now so while we were waiting for the body shop to finish up the paint on the A6 I actually picked this floor mats up from Expert OC I ordered it through Shock The Mob on Instagram I'm gonna leave the link in the description below as well these floor mats are pretty much the same style as um, the Drift King Taiji Shuchiya's um, A6. So let's open it up and check it out. How much did you pay for it? Uh, like 200 bucks. <laughs> 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 now let's open it. Yeah, let's open up this $200 floor mat. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, that's where I ordered it, which is Expert OC. And the reason why I ordered this um, floor mat is because I actually special ordered it for uh, to fit my roll bar. As you can see, it comes with it's already pre-cut for the roll bar, so it's gonna look way better than what I had before. I actually picked this uh, similar style floor mat from China for like twenty bucks, <laughs> Excuse which me? is which is like they look ten the times cheaper. They look the same, bro. But they don't really fit right. That's the thing. So let's take them out now. Ding -dong. Now let's install the new floor mats. Yeah, I believe this is the driver's side. They fit perfectly. Do you think it's worth it? No. <laughs> I can buy two set of Nago. <laughs> now let's install the rest. I think it's worth it. <laughs> Whatever you say, so. <laughs> it looks way better. Okay. If it's good too. Cool. The last piece. But no one really sits in the back. <laughs> The $200 ones and the $20 ones. <laughs> I bought them basically is because it fits my robot, basically. I can cut the $20 one to fit your robot too. <laughs> <laughs> so that's a wrap for today's video. I hope you all enjoy the new look of our A6. So if you love what we do at Fujiwara Tofu Cafe, make sure you like this video, subscribe our channel, and leave us a comment down below. So as always, everything starts with a dream. Later! Bye! Bye-bye!